Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try this turkey dinner. It's roasted white meat turkey with mashed potatoes and green beans. This is one of these chef meals that Walmart's been selling. This one is the Andrew Zimmern meal and it was at Walmart for $5.94. It's a 10.25 ounce or 291 gram meal. Doesn't look too bad. The green beans looked very uh, blanched or steamed. So we'll see. I like mine cooked with an inch of their life, but we'll see what they're like. Um, the whole meal is 300 calories. There's your other info for you. And he says, I love turkey and it's not just for the holidays. My family loves this meal year round. Uh, it's classic slow roasted turkey on fluffy buttery mashed potatoes with a rich turkey gravy and tender green beans. We microwave it. I don't see any other directions on there. So it's just microwave only. So lift the film of all the vent, place the bowl in the microwave and cook for four minutes. Lift the film and stir and walk away for another one minute until the center of the dish reaches 165. Get your thermometers out, right? So four minutes, stir, and one. Okay, green beans are just like thrown in there. So I'm going to vent this a little bit and get it in the microwave, and uh, I'll be back when it comes out. Okay, so here it is out of the microwave, and you can see it just kind of gets stirred all together. I mean, it's turkey and green beans and everything. It's like a, it's like a little stew or a pot pie or something. So you get some turkey. It's not a large amount of turkey, but you do get some pieces of turkey in there. Um, green beans, you know, they're spread everywhere. They are the kind that's been blanched. I'm pretty sure because they feel, they feel pretty tough. So, um, so anyway, I'm gonna get this over the table, let it cool a little bit. I'll be back. Okay, right, so I'm gonna try the green beans and the potatoes because I can't, um, they're all stirred together. So you can't avoid the eating some of the, the stuff mixed together. So here we go. Mm. Definitely blanched. They are, um, they almost have that, that crunchy rubbery kind of texture that, that really undercooked green beans have to me. Um, yeah, it's, it's almost like eating a raw green bean. So we can skip the green beans entirely for now. I've tried them. I have my opinion of them. And that doesn't increase my, that doesn't change my mind about the opinion of steamed or blanched vegetables. I still don't like them. They're, uh, they're okay. I can eat them, but it's just, uh, like I said, I like mine really well cooked. And these are just really um, crunchy and chewy. I mean, they're crunchy on the outside, but they still have some kind of like a rubbery, chewy kind of texture to them. Eh, it's not for me. Um, here's the turkey and mashed potatoes. Like I said, they're all mixed together, so you can't avoid um, getting the mashed potatoes and the gravy on everything. Hmm. The turkey's good and tender. I like the flavor of that. The uh, the mashed potatoes the, and the gravy, they have a good flavor as well. They um, It tastes like your traditional frozen milk potato though so it doesn't taste special or anything like that but it does taste like if you're used to eating frozen dinner mashed potatoes this is this is typical now that piece of turkey was dry but the rest of them i've had have been very um tender and moist so i think that was maybe just a piece of turkey that was on the edge that didn't um, sit in the gravy for a little while because everything else has been very um, tender so like I said there's quite a bit of turkey in here there's enough turkey in here to get a bite of turkey and mashed potatoes in pretty much every bite so um, so that's good what I would probably do is I would probably just since they're already mixed together anyway I would just get green beans and turkey and mashed potatoes and eat it all together That way, for me, it covers up the texture of that my green bean a little bit. I think this is good. I, I think this is better than some of the um, turkey and dressing meals, which are really just uh, little croutons dropped on top, and, and hopefully they soak, they soften up from the gravy. That's kind of what, how they're done. Um, this is better than those, so I'm glad they didn't go with a dressing or a stuffing. Um, this is just literally turkey medallions, uh, slices, whatever you want to call them, and. Uh, an okay mashed potato and a really not for me green bean. 
Um, so that being said, I do like the textures of everything except the green beans. I like the textures of the turkey and I like the textures of the, uh, the, uh, the turkey and the mashed potatoes. It's really good. The turkey, the mashed potatoes aren't gloopy or sticky or clumped up or glue-like or anything like that. So they're nice. Um, Flavor-wise, the flavor of everything is pretty good. The green beans are a little, again, because they are blanched, they're just uh, a very green, green bean flavor. They're not like a cooked green bean. They're very green, very strong. Um, with that being said, though, I do like the flavor of the mashed potatoes and the gravy and the turkey. It's, it's got a decent flavor to it. It's really good. Um, I'm going to give this one like a four out of five. I do like it. I would definitely eat it again. It's just the green beans. I have to kind of eat it all together with, uh, with everything else because it's a personal choice. I just don't like them. Um, you might love blanched green beans, but um, if you don't, then this is not gonna change your mind. It's the same thing. So um, yeah, I think I'm gonna give it a four out of five. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.